I'm going to share with you exactly how worthy, exactly how valuable and deserving you really are of living an extraordinary and incredible life. When you achieve real worthiness, real deserving within yourself, life begins to open up all kinds of new possibilities and opportunities to you. You are able to show up in your life and be the more that has always been dwelling within you. And I believe that if you're here seeing this video, I believe that you have always felt that and understood that at a core level. So it's not that you're not enough and you need to learn how to be more. It's that you are enough, you already are deserving, you already are worthy, but you're just not being who you really are in your life. There are many important categories in our life. I will use these categories to describe to you exactly how you can apply and get real benefit and real success in your life instantly from just seeing this video. These categories are benefiting our relationships, benefiting our finances, benefiting our health and well-being, and so on and so forth. So we are gonna approach each of these topics in this video and give real examples on how you can access and unlock this real worthiness, this real deserving in your life. There have been many times in my life where I have accomplished great things and I have been very high up on the top of the mountain, so to speak, where I would achieve what it was I set out to and then I would push the self-destruct button. I'd start sabotaging it, tearing it down. Now within myself was this unconscious energy and this unconscious pattern that I needed to recognize to be able to take my life to the next level of abundance, of success. I needed to understand and realize that I am deserving of it because if you don't think you are deserving of something at a core level of who you are, then you will manifest all kinds of behaviors, thinking, attitude, actions in your life that will sabotage your relationships, it will sabotage your finances, it will sabotage your success, and you will sabotage your own health. All right, there's, a, there's been many times in my life, for example, because of my undeserving ideas about money and my negative beliefs about it, where I achieved great wealth that nobody in my family had ever seen anything like that. And I encountered it in my own life and it was amazing. At first I was so pumped, I was like, look what I accomplished. But I immediately began to use that money in ridiculous ways that ended up taking me from being the richest person in my family that we had ever known to being the most in debt person that we had ever known. Okay, so we need to realize that what is happening within us on a level of deserving, what is happening within us on a core level of belief is directly impacting the way that we are operating in reality. And the way we are operating, the choices we make, directly create what our future experience will be. Knowing that you deserve an incredible partnership, knowing that you deserve incredible abundance and wealth, knowing that you deserve a community that cares about you, that loves you, knowing that you deserve great friends who you can depend upon, knowing that you deserve incredible health that gives you the energy to show up every day and enjoy and love the heck out of your life and to feel great about it. You need to know that you deserve these things. This is the distinction that we need to make to take it to the next level in our lives. And if you're here seeing this video, I know you are ready for this next level. I just know it. And it's the difference between confidence and worthiness. Confidence. Confidence is something that a lot of people seek in their lives. But confidence, there's a problem with it. Confidence comes from, I'm confident in myself because I look good. I'm confident in myself because I've got nice hair, right? I'm confident because I have this beautiful girlfriend or boyfriend. I'm confident because I've got all this money and success and fame or whatever. Right, this is confidence. Here's the problem with confidence. We can't control entirely, we can control some areas of our life, but we can't control entirely everything that's happening around us. And life is always subject to change. We don't know what could happen. That beautiful girlfriend we had that was a source of our confidence might leave us, right? That massive amount of money that you made, this happened to a lot of people back in the day when there was the big depression. People who were super confident in themselves, millionaires, were suddenly one day jumping off of buildings and committing suicide because they had lost everything in their minds, because they based all of their confidence, all of their worth off of this thing, off of their car, off of their finances. And when the market crashed and they lost that, they could not stand anymore. They couldn't stand up with the courage that it would take to rebuild wealth in a new kind of way. So what I'm trying to help you to see is when we're confident about our looks, guess what? 
our looks are always changing. You know what? One day, I'm gonna be wrinkled like a raisin, and I'm not gonna be so banging that all the girls are turning their heads when I walk in. <laughs> Sometimes even still they don't. I don't know why, I thought unibrows are totally in right now. <laughs> the point is, is that these things are all subject to change. So when you base your worth off of things that are confidence-based, you are holding on to an illusory power. That's not real power. That's not where deserving comes from. So I wanna encourage you in this video to make a distinction. Don't seek out to get confidence in your life. It's, it's just not where we wanna go. Right? When you want to grow a strong tree, you water the roots. Gaining confidence is like watering leaves thinking that's going to change your life and grow a bigger tree. It won't. We want to water the roots. And the roots are worthiness. Not confidence, worthiness. Self-worth. Understanding the value within you, that you are great, that you are special, that there is something very powerful and special within you that you have that nobody can take away with you. It doesn't matter if a huge crazy tsunami comes in and it's rainstorms or the market crashes or your girlfriend leaves you. You have something that no one can take away from you. That is self-worth. Earlier in the video, I mentioned that if you want more out of life, then you have to be more. This is where self-worth comes into play. When you understand the worthiness within you that is not based on confidence, it's real worthiness, again, something that cannot take, be taken away from you no matter what changes, your looks, your finances, no matter what changes, you still have this. It's, it's the specialness within you. It's, it's a piece of your spirit that you have woken up to and acknowledged that, in my opinion, what it is for me is a special purpose that I'm here to fulfill. Nobody and nothing can take that away from me. That's my example. I know if you look within yourself, you'll discover what it is for you. For me, it's my purpose. It's this beautiful spirit and energy within me that just wants to give and share and uplift others around me. That gives me a sense of courage and not confidence, but worthiness because I know I'm great. It's, it's a greatness that I've seen within me. And again, nothing can challenge it. Now, because I have such a strong sense of self-worth, Understand that what that makes me do in my life is it makes me show up every day and give everything that I do, like these videos, everything I've got. I show up in life and I be more because I have self-worth. If you have self-worth, you show up in your day inspired, motivated, passionate about what it is that you're doing. When you have self-worth, you show up in life and you be more. And because you're giving more, life rewards this kind of person. We tap into abundance where more and more comes into our lives. It is a really special flow to be in. And this flow can only happen because of this worthiness we've discovered. Let's take the example of money. Now, if you want more money in your life, then you need to understand that money is a value exchange. So unless you give more value to others, you're not going to be able to get more money. It's really that simple. So this is you. If you want this money to come to you, first, you have to go to people who, who need help and you have to help them to solve their problems. And that's when money can come to you. So we have a perfect example here with our financial system that's set up in place that the way that money works shows us and demonstrates this very fact. If you want more, you have to be more. Now, if you don't think that you are worthy, if you don't think that you are valuable, if you don't think that there's something valuable within you that can help others, then you're never going to show up and help those people who need help. Somebody could come into your very door and ask you for help and you could say, sorry, I don't know how to help you. But inside of you, we both know that you do have a very special value. But until you acknowledge that value, until you acknowledge that self-worth, you're never gonna show up and help people because you don't believe you're capable of it and you're never gonna allow a greater flow of abundance of money to come to you. It's that simple. So let's look at one more example. Relationships. In a relationship, you need to give love, you need to give friendship in order to get it back. 
Now, in order to really realize this, think back to any time in your life if you've ever had this experience where you're friends with somebody and you ask them, let's hang, or you're trying to vibe with them and they just say, sorry, not interested. Okay, well, most sane individuals are willing to acknowledge that that's reality, it's life, it happens sometimes. But if every single time, day after day, if you give them a month without inter interacting with them, you text them, hey, let's hang out. If they say not interested, if they're always not giving you friendship in return, you will eventually stop reaching out to them. That's just the truth. It's just the energy dynamics in reality. So again, we have a perfect emphasis here that if you want to get something out of life, then you need to give what it is that you're interested in getting. Money is value. If you want money, give value. Friendship is also value. You're sharing the value of your company. You're sharing the value of your energy. You're, you're sharing space with someone, letting them know that they're not alone. If you don't give that to someone, then you're not going to get it in return. And this guy right here is a perfect example of that because the guy that expects friendship from others but doesn't understand how to give it in return will end up in a reality with no friends. So we're looking at here the perfect demonstration, I hope, to help you to see that reality works in this energy exchange. It, again, if you want more out of life, you need to be more. It's just that simple. When you know that you are great, when you have real worthiness within yourself, you are willing to show up every day and be great. You don't hold yourself back. You don't go, oh no, oh I'm, I don't have enough of this, I'm not confident enough. When you have real worthiness, you be great. Think about it. You show up and you do more in everything that you do because you have worthiness. And because you put out more, because you do more, more comes back to you. So you launch your life into higher levels of success. And there's only one place you're gonna get that. And it's not more money. It's not more fame reviews. You know, it's not even a relationship. It's not even money. It's it really is none of that. There's only one source and one place it comes from and it comes from looking within yourself and learning who am I really? What really matters to me? What do I really want to do in this life? What gets me up in the morning and makes me go to sleep with such great peace of mind? That's where it comes from. And the joke is that when we start living and breathing from that energetic place, everybody wants to date you. The money can't stop coming in your bank account. <laughs> Everything just takes off. It's, it's this hilarious, ironic thing that once you surrender your need for that external manifestation and you just be who you are unconditionally, now you've discovered the true foundation of being somebody who's really ready to receive that next level of success in your life. Thanks. I hope to see you for the next video. Much love to you and see you soon.